I got a text message from a woman about a month ago. She wanted to encourage her husband to start a practice of deliberate cold exposure. He was struggling with PTSD and he was using alcohol to numb his feelings. And she wanted to know if the cold exposure could help him for stress. So we talked a little bit about the articles that I've written on trauma and shivering. I got another text message from her the other day. It's been about a month and he's been doing his cold plunge with little exercise afterwards, just like she'd read in my articles. She said he hasn't had a drop of alcohol in three weeks. But then she said something else had changed. His libido had gone through the roof. She and her husband had a good laugh about it, but it's not surprising. When you do cold exposure in your ice bath, and then you do some exercise. For men, they get a big boost in testosterone. And testosterone is the lust hormone. The Czech Army commissioned a study. It's the first study I've ever seen. They use the same protocol that I talk about. Cold exposure and then some light exercise. They took 28, 29, I forget exactly how many, but almost 30 soldiers, men and women, and they put them through that protocol and then asked them, how was their quality of life? They measured a bunch of different things in their body composition. Nobody really lost weight, but everybody reported that their life satisfaction and in particular, their sex lives went up. When the study period was over, most of the participants asked the researchers that were performing this study for the Czech army, could we keep it up? We still want to do our ice baths.